Hey guys, how are you going? My name is Dom and today I want to talk about default parameters inside functions within JavaScript. So essentially, default parameters are a way to um, provide your functions with default data if it's not actually given. So let's see with an example. Let's declare a new function and we'll call this one Dom and this will take in two parameters. It'll be A and then B. Okay. Inside here, I'm simply just going to console.log um, the sum of a and b. So we'll say log and then a plus b. Okay, simple stuff. Now, down here, I'm going to call this function. I'm going to say, okay, DOM, and then pass in 10 and 5. Now, we should see 15 in the console. Let's just run this script, all right, and see how we go. We get 15. All right, so now what if I was to get rid of this 5 here? Get rid of the 5 and just put 10 inside there. Saving this and running it one more time. This time we get NAN, so not a number. So it's basically just trying to console.log 10 plus undefined. If I was to log out just B, for example, and try this one, we get undefined. So you can't add up 10 and undefined. It's not going to work. So let's add a default parameter to this, um, sorry, a default value to this B parameter. That way, it's always going to work. So I'm going to say B and then equals 10. Okay, so now it's going to, I'm going to call this function, pass in one argument, that'll be A, and then B is going to be 10 because I don't actually provide 10 here. So if I save this one, run this program, this time we get 20 right there. So you can see how it works. Now, if I was to go inside here and just pass in 5 one more time and save it, this time we get 15 once again. So now it's basically just going to ignore this one and instead use the um, argument like normal. Alright, that's the basics right there. Now, I do want to show you how you can actually have a normal parameter and then a default value parameter and then a third normal parameter. For example, Let's say A, B, then add C inside there. I'm going to just log out um, C as well. So A plus B plus C. So now, um, if I was to go inside here and just pass in something like 10, we should now get uh, 25. And we get 25 right there. But let's just say I don't want to actually provide a value for um, the second argument here. Let's say I want to put in null. If I put in null right there, it's going to actually say 20. So it's adding a plus um, null plus c. So 10 plus nothing plus 10 is going to be 20. Really, I actually want to add 10. So I want to actually say, okay, if I don't provide a value for this one, then use the default argument. Right now, it's using null. Okay. To actually make it use the default parameter or value, you pass in undefined. So 10 undefined and then 10 will give you 10 plus 10 here and then plus 10. So now we get 30 in the console. So essentially this default parameter is going to check if a value is undefined. If it is undefined, then we're going to use the default value right there. All right. And that is how you can use default function um, parameters in JavaScript. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you later.